Tarragona has access to multiple types of waters for doing water experiments. Municipal water, sea water, as well as industrial wastewater. Having all of those feed streams, they really do deliver a nice profile of what's out in the world. And allowing us to do that under controlled conditions with our experts that are right there, that's what has really been quite impressive about the impact of Tarragona. In this facility, we process 10,000 cubic meters of water per day, enough water to supply a city with a population of around 100,000 people. So what makes the Tarragona facility unique is the ability for us to do R&D experiments, doing exactly what our customers do in the volumes of water that they treat. So this allows us to scale things very quickly in a Tarragona facility from R&D experiments to full-scale industrial experiments. These are not trivial things and so when we deal with very large problems, whether it's desalination or cleaning up impaired waters, people come to us, they look for us for solutions, they look for expertise. And that's what we've delivered over the last six decades. We can come up with a lot of ideas, but fundamentally it starts with the customer telling us, hey, I have a problem. So listening to those kind of heartbeats out in the marketplace of what customers are telling us, that's what drives us. That's how we focus. So customers love this facility in Tarragona because we can work hand in hand using exactly the same type of waters that they have. So we can look at new technologies, develop processes with their resources on site. They can come and see how it works. They can come and see what kind of diligence we're putting in to the development to help them say, okay, I get it, this is really working. The operations team and analytical team are very key to our innovations and in water and process solutions. Not only do the operators run the experiments, which are very complex because we're dealing with various types of waters, also the analytical labs are there to analyse the waters and analyse the elements and the results of these experiments. And it's really the collaboration between those two groups that brings together our innovation. We have to test new products, so we are developing them. We are making tests to improve these technologies to one day get them on the market. Here uh, at the control room we have two operator stations where we can control two lines of ultrafiltration. Then we can control also three lines of reverse osmosis. Our team provides data to help customers to solve global water challenges. We have more than 80 tests and we receive more than 2,000 samples every month. Expertise is everything. I mean, products by themselves don't just work. They need people to help make sure that it's in the right situation, make sure the conditions are correct. And that's what we're actually getting out of Tarragona as well. So for the next innovations that we're working on around the globe as well as in Tarragona are around energy, energy savings, for example, where we develop new membrane technology that allows us to reduce the energy for brackish water, so more like industrial water waste, by 33%. So 33% less energy to generate the water. For seawater applications, we've also developed our CMAX products, which generate 10% energy savings for our customers. Customers. So through these innovations that we're carrying out within the whole global R&D organisation of Dow Water and Process Solutions, we can show the value of these innovations in terms of energy savings, both for industrial applications as well as desalination. It's through this entire collaborative effort that we allow our team to innovate and bring the best technology to our customers through Dow Water and Process Solutions. Innovation isn't one thing to take lightly and that people will just trust you unless you've earned that trust. And that's what we do every day. We try to earn that trust every day.